Hey guys, Sharkin here, and welcome to another 5 minute gold farming video. Today we will be looking at the mob named Foreman Thistle Nettle, located inside the tunnels leading towards the dead mines, but not in the dungeon itself, so just outside of it. The reason we are farming this ugly ass undead guy is for two of his loot. He drops three noteworthy items, but only two of them can be sold on the auction house. The other is soulbound. They are the foreman's leggings, worth around 19k, and the foreman's gloves, worth around 23k, according to Wowhead. But of course, this is all depending on, you know, your server and how stupid your competition is with undercutting. Back when server hop was still a big thing and worked in every zone, this was farmed by many people for his drops. With a respawn timer of around 6 minutes, it was pretty much guaranteed, you know, him to be up and the drop rate under 1%, it was quite a hard thing to farm for. Now that the server hop is no longer global and you need the party leader to be in the same zone, there are only a few ways you can farm this, because server hop isn't going to work like the old method. For alliance, you can use any class, but I would suggest using a Windwalker Monk with Ox Statue and Chi Orbit, so you can do this semi-AFK, and you just fly over to Westfall, and then you go underneath into the caves towards the dead mines. When you arrive at the spawn location of the foreman, you can just set up your totem and check every 6 minutes to just loot and refresh your totem while you do something else. This is pretty much the easiest way to farm this without, you know, going insane because if you sit there and wait for him, it's so boring. With a monk, you can just sit back, you know, relax, watch a movie, play WoW on your other account and do many other things and just remember to loot every 6 minutes. For Horde, the best way to get there is to take the Zeppelin from Ogrima down to Stranglethorn Vale and fly on up towards Westfall. Same thing, you can just use any class, but best is Monk. If you don't have a Monk, you can just always use a class trial and farm for 8 hours before it locks you out. Just remember to mail everything before you reach the 8 hour mark. Because, you know, it will just lock you out. Something like 7 hours 30 minutes just to be safe. Because once it locks out, the only way to unlock it is to pay the big dollars, which it's not worth it. The second way is to farm this is to use the server hop method I mentioned in many of my other videos by using a level 1 if you have two accounts and bring it to Westfall, or if you only have one account, you have to bring a level 100 class trial on the same account to Westfall. It doesn't need to be inside the mine, it just needs to be in the land Westfall itself, so anywhere as soon as it says Westfall and invite your person inside the mines to change realms. Each person you bring will give you an extra kill every 6 minutes. So, you know, if you have just two realms to jump to, so if you have your own realm and one other, you'd have, you know, two every 6 minutes, and then three every 6 minutes, four. You know, it just goes faster and faster, and it will increase the speed you farm this at. Personally, I'm not going to farm this with multiple accounts, because I have more than one WoW account, and I can just leave my monk there and loot every 6 minutes, while still playing with my other account, like, you know, doing other farms. I'd rather not put too much effort into this farm, but some of you might just want to farm the gloves and the pants as soon as possible, so, you know, you can never need to come back to this god-awful place again. Thanks again for watching as always. If you enjoyed it, then like, comment, and subscribe if you'd like to stay updated with my channel. I love you guys so much, and, you know, you've all been a great help towards me and my channel, and I hope you guys have a great day and I hope the RNG gods favor you. Bye bye.